topic of discussion is product life cycle. A product life, life cycle refers to different stages a product undergoes from introduction to withdrawal or decline. Like I said, a product will undergo different stages. The first stage of a product life cycle is introduction stage. The second stage is growth stage. The third stage is maturity. And the last stage is decline. Is decline stage. Now, in the introduction stage, a product will have a lot of expenses which will be incurred in introducing a product. Mostly, the expenses which a product incurs is research and development. Now, in this stage, the sales will not be too high and the expenses are more. Therefore, the product will have high costs and a company will not make more profits under introduction stage. The next stage here is growth stage. Here, a lot of research and development will not happen and because of this, the expenses are much lesser and the company is established, the product is established. Therefore, will not be having that much of expenses and profits are more. The next stage here is maturity stage and this is the stage where the product is highly established. It will have high profits. The company will have to look into it that the, co the company will move on in the same direction and does not stop its research and development. If the research and development is stopped at this stage, then the product is definitely going to decline and it will perish from the market. To give, give you an example, I could quote the automobile industry. Right now, we have self-driven cars which are into existence. It is still under the introduction stage. That means not many people are buying the product and a lot of research and development is happening for the self-driven cars. In the growth stage, we all know electric cars. There, are, there is market for electric cars and people are opting for electric cars because it has more uh, good characteristics like it is more environment friendly and more charging points are available. That is why we can say that electric cars are under the growth stage. The next is maturity stage. In the same automobile industry, we can say that there is a maturity stage of diesel and petrol. There is a maturity stage for petrol vehicles. That is, they are under the highest level and later on they may go extinct because of the introduction of electric vehicles. The next is decline stage. Under decline stage, we have we no more are you we no more are producing diesel vehicles. So we can say that these diesel vehicles are under the decline stage. So this is what a product life cycle will look like. 